Piper Jones House Tavern puzzles are hand forged by blacksmith Dennis Suckersley. He's interested in preserving the traditions and he has many reproductions of some of the most famous tavern puzzles plus some of his own new creations. These have been called challenging, intellectual, mind-boggling, fun. The object of the puzzle is just to take one piece out. And the solution can take three moves or 43 moves, and they all come with directions, but not solutions. They're all handcrafted in the United States, and they're made by one of the last remaining blacksmiths around. So what is a tavern puzzle, you might ask? And the answer to that question is it's an iron disentanglement puzzle. And what that means is that there are portions of the puzzle that will fit and work around other parts of the puzzle in a mechanical solution. Now, initially, these were used to train a young apprentice blacksmith in a forging exercise. What I've done is I've taken the idea behind that and I've concentrated more on the puzzle aspect. So although my designs would also be a forging exercise, they also have a bit more to the solution, which make them a little bit more of a puzzle. Now this is my newest puzzle for this year. It's called Smarty Pants. And the object piece is this ring. And you can see if you do the moves just right, you too can be a Smarty Pants. But don't let it fool you. There's a lot going on here and there's a good bit of time necessary to manipulate and to find out what all the little pieces are able to do so that you deal with like little rings that are being a problem right now as you can see and things like that but a little jiggle, a little shaking it'll come right back to where it started. Patience puzzle is based on an ancient Chinese puzzle. It's more of a mathematical puzzle than a mechanical puzzle and it has 43 steps to its solution but it's constructed out of nails that are produced on a machine that was built during the Civil War and still in operation today. George Bush Sr. wrote to Dennis to get a solution to one of the tougher puzzles. Apparently he's an avid collector. But don't forget, the solution isn't just getting it apart, but also putting it back together. That's right.